In this video, uh, we will see how to use uh, scale bar and uh, color bar. So first, let us uh, see how to use the scale bar. I am just removing this, modifying this transfer function and then I just move out the, the transfer function editor. So this is uh, an engine block data set and we would like to see the uh, scale bar so in order to look at the scale bar press space bar and then give scale bar so c a e b a r scale bar or you can go here in the command help and press s and that's the scale bar so for the scale bar you give uh, how many voxels or how many voxel units you would like to display in your scale bar so let's say 100 which is default say 100 units so that is the scale bar here now this mm is because in the volume information so it, during the import or um, or via volume information panel here you might have given box unit as millimeters or you can give it as say for example no units in that case this will display it as uh, 10 voxels same millimeters now now this scale bar is valid only um, for the central part of the um, of the uh, of the bounding box so let me just turn on the bounding box by pressing B so this is the bounding box now this is true because we are in a perspective projection so if I move out or scale down then you will see that this scale bar also changes its size now when I switch to orthographic projection here yeah, this is orthographic projection and double click here so if I move that around so that's 100 voxels now we know that this data is 256 by 256 by 110 so let me just put it here so let me remove this scale bar so hover over the scale bar and then press delete it will delete the scale bar press space bar again and then give scale bar let's put two scale bars one at 110 and the other at uh, 256 so there are two scale bars one at 110 and the other at 100 and, uh, 256 so what first let's compare the 110 so we are in orthographic projection so these should match exactly so you can move around your scale bar here it is so move it down it should match exactly so So these are the scale bars now now we want to have vertical measurement so again hover over this scale bar 256 mm scale bar and press V so H and V so horizontal and vertical so these are two ways in which you can have your scale bar and then the text you can have it at up or down or left or right so up down left and right just changes the position of the of your scale bar uh, of the text of your scale bar so here we have or you can have it as right here
So this is the way in which you can have your scale bars.